which visionary historical figure was quoted as saying, let he who is without sin cast the first stone? Didn't Danny Minogue say that on the X Factor? Visionary historical figure? Kylie. Jesus Christ. Anyway, we can come back to that one. Okay, um, uh, oh, here we go. In which European city would you find the Tower of London? Oh, I know this one. It's, um, it's in that really old, there's lots of old buildings and there's the really, really big clock. No, no, um, no, 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 I remember this. This is a trick question. <laughs> yeah, the trick is not being a fucking moron. Did you hear something? It's at the bar. Mmm, where's the Tower of London? Are you fucking kidding me? London. England. It said, in which European city would you find the Tower of London? The Tower of London? London's not even in Europe. Neither's England, you dumb bitch. No, 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 Polly. Can't you see? She's blind. Well, she'd have to be dressed like that. I mean, that's the worst drag I've seen since Whitney Houston's comeback to her. I am <laughs> not a fucking drag queen, you stupid cow. These puppies are fucking real, and I've got more balls than you'll ever have, you dumb bitch. Oh, hey, hey, settle down, Brandy. Oh. Sorry, girls, my sister's... She... Look, she doesn't mean any harm. Like hell I don't. She's your sister? Yeah, how awful. When did she go blind? I am not blind. Maybe not, but you're certainly going that way. Come on, love, let's go. Hey Brandon, there's no gin in my vodka tonic. There's no gin in vodka tonics, Brandy. Don't you worry about it, Jackie boy. How's trick? Brandy's just making some new friends, Jack. How are things with you? How's your mum? I'm getting better. And mum, well, mum's condition is unchanged. How do you mean? She's still a racist bigoted, homophobic, thank you, homophobic, bleach blonde, loving mother of two from Mount Isa. She's always pretty nice to me. Only because she wants to break you and Brendan up. Oh, come on, really? I'd be careful if I were you, Jack. She told me you reminded her of Dad. Oh, no. Yep. Fuck. What does that mean? Don't you worry about it. One thing though, I wouldn't let her know you've got HIV. Not a good idea. I tried to tell him. Why not? You tell him. Peter Allen. What? Peter Allen is mum's all-time fantasy hunk of man-made. God. The... I go to Rio, Peter Allen. None other than. Mum's just nutty about him. She didn't believe me when I told her he was gay. It was only when I told her that he danced with Judy Garland and married Liza Minnelli that she was convinced. She thinks Liza Minnelli's really a man. Who spells it with a Z? And when she found out that he had HIV and died of AIDS... Wow. Put it this way. Liza's been getting hate mail ever since for robbing the world of a musical genius. But he wrote, I still call Australia home for fuck's sake. Yeah, Mum thinks that should be the national anthem. Tell him about the maracas. Not the maracas. He has to know. Mum still has a pair of maracas he threw into the audience at a concert in 1974. She told us they were her most prized possession, that if Dad ever decides to set fire to the house, to make sure we saved those maracas. Brendan? Why have you not shared any of this with me? This is serious. Why didn't you tell me? Shame! Shame. But she doesn't really think that your dad's going to set fire to the house, does she? I mean, how crazy is he? He's been married to Mum for 30 years, Jack. Good point, Brendan. Top me up.